Alright, this is a reading for Gemini. We're going to start off with a playlist. Um, John Mayer, Edge of Desire, Sir Elton John, Cradle in the Wind, Mariah Carey, Oh Holy Night, Linkin Park, Crawling, um, Earth, Wind, and Fire, Shiny Star, um, The Beatles, I Saw Her Standing There, Tyre Cruz, Dynamite, The Beatles, And I Love Her, um, Mariah Carey again with Hero, um, Robbie um, Williams, Angels, Britney Spears, Oops, I Did It Again, um, One Direction, What Makes You Beautiful, and America, Sister, Golden Hair, and there was another one I was channeling when I was reading this. Um, anyway, those are your songs for this week. You can vibe out to them, and I will be adding, I believe, one more to that to make 14. And your first card, how you feel right now, is going to be the Five of Cups in reverse. The end of relationships, the failure of business, death of a loved one, uh, depression, depressive mood, um, a terminal illness. So again, like with Aries, you're kind of in like a, <laughs> you're kind of done. Um, so, something happened either in your family or to a loved one. And it has you in a depressive mood. It could be the end of a relationship and you're kind of, you know, thinking to yourself, I wasn't the one, you know, I, I'm never picked or whatever. And and you're just feeling depressed. Um, so, you know, you have to, you know, think about something else. You can't always be depressed about something. If you're, if you're independent now, you get to do whatever the hell you want. Um, anyway, we have week's theme. Week's theme is the Empress. The Empress is financial abundance, pregnancy and birth, desirable results, um, reassurance, supportive females, and amazing results. So your friends, your family, probably your mom, will be very supportive of your recent <laughs> independence if you got rid of a, a, you know, a boyfriend, girlfriend situation, um, and if it's a failure in business, there's always a point in which things turn around, you know, um, so it, it could be that, um, a lot of things are holding you back, if there's a death in the family, maybe you're getting an inheritance, if it's the end of a relationship, maybe you uh, still own your business, whatever the case, or it could be going back to a family business or being able to make your own money from your own ideas. Um, whatever the case, it, it, it's a big <laughs> freedom lock for you. Um, and the challenge of this week is the King of Pentacles in Reverse. The King of Pentacles in Reverse is can be dogmatic, only does what is expected of them, um, materialistic, overly focused on finances. So this could be you or somebody else. Um, so if it's like finance, everybody's kind of, you know, into finances. And it's a very dogmatic way to look at life. Like, I need money, I need to do this and get money. I need to do this and get money. Um, it's very robotic. Um, lesson to remember, something you have already learned that will serve you well this week. Um, it's going to be the Seven of Wands. The Seven of Wands is advantage, um, negotiation, self defense, um, principle, standing your ground. So you're, you're really going to be a little bit argumentative, maybe to the point of, you know, getting what you need or getting what you want out of the situation. And, um, if it is a divorce, it's going to be like you're taking your ex to the cleaners. Um, but you know, that's only for some. <laughs> Um, and then we have the lesson of the week, which is the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups is, um, psychic, empathetic, um, loyal, compassionate, loving, and overlooking. So, in this case, <laughs> in this case, it, it could be you or your ex. They're going to play the you know, I loved you at one point, guard, and you're just gonna be like, I'm out. Um, 
Or they're going to be like that, like, you know, you were just in it for whatever reason. But it, it's going to be evenly matched, for sure. It's not going to be one side. It's going to be, like, all y'all are just fighting for the sake of fighting. Like, maybe, like, you take their argument and use it against them at a certain point. Or whatever the case. But it's like, it's a bad breakup, whatever it is. And it's just going to get worse as time goes on. Um, the Page of Wands in reverse is the gift this week. And 